and it will not work out too far from you. There, there was an energetic and happy hare and a sleepy tortoise. One day they had an argument. I am the fastest animal in the whole wide world, said hare. Oh, do be quiet, said, said tortoise. You are so full of yourself. I will prove to you all that I am the fastest animal in the whole wide world. Hare both did. Okay, said tortoise. All right, see you then. Hare laughed his head off. Just be wait and see, said tortoise. I'll, I'll get the wise old owl to organize a race for us. The wise owl will arrange the race for the next day. When your marks get set, go, called owl. And the race was off. Slowly, slowly, tortoise set off. Quickly, quickly, Hare raced off, and soon he was out of sight. In fact, he was so far ahead that when he looked back, Tortoise was nowhere to be seen. Gosh, Hare thought a more or less one already. I think I'll just have a little nap under the tree. It's such a hot day. Hare soon, was soon fast asleep. Meanwhile, Tortoise strolled along slowly enjoying the sun on his shell and taking the odd nibble of grass, of grass from time to time. On and on and on and on and on he walked. He walked past the old tree. He passed the bridge. He passed the cow shed. He even walked past here. He was still snoring under a tree. So big. I think I should restart from here. He, the, he walked until he came to the finish line where Owl and all the other animals in the field were gathered. All the animals gathered around Torsters, cheering and shouting, Well done, well done, you're the winner. All the noise woke her up with a start. What's going on? What's all that noise? Never mind. I'd better finish the race then I can go have my dinner. He fought. Harry started to hit the finish line, but when he got there, to his horror, he saw Tertius with a glass, with a gold medal around his neck. I can't, this can't be right. He must have cheated. Everyone knows I'm faster than him. Doctors didn't cheat, said Owl. He won fair and square, slowly and surely, never giving up. Doctors passed the finish line first. Sorry, Harry, but you lost this race. Let that be a lesson to you. Slow and steady wins the race. Her and her look very unhappy. Doctors and Tortoise and Tortoise felt sorry for him. They tried to cheer him up. Cheer up, Hare. It was only a race. Tortoise said, I'm sure you'll win the next one. I'd rather we will still be friends than win every race under the sun. And from that day on, they became best of friends and her ever braved again. The end.